Hey guys! I know I'm back to the weird camera angle, I can't be bothered to stack you with books because it is currently a time, it is 20 to 11, this is one of the latest times I've stayed up all week. Uh, yeah, okay. This is a new thing that I did on Wednesday. I cut a load of my hair off. And we had a dress up day at school today for children in need, so that was awesome. Lovely day. Support children in need. Woo. And the theme this year was favourite childhood character. So I was Velma. I don't own an orange one, so I wore this. And I was wearing a skirt. I'm not now. Because as I... Well, the skirt fit me fairly snugly when I bought it. And I've unfortunately gone up half a size since then. So I currently have a bruise on my side that hurts a lot. <laughs> because the skirt was too small so I changed out of it and now my sister has a skirt that she's been eyeing since I got it anyway we had the dress up day and that was fun and one of the year eights in my form because we have vertical tutoring um, didn't see me yesterday because I got my hair cut on Wednesday because I have Wednesdays off and she didn't see me yesterday so when I came into school today she thought I was wearing a wig because she's heard me talk about it because obviously the wig I wore for my Poison Ivy costume a few weeks ago but no, this is my actual hair and I'm still getting used to it I love it I was originally going to go uh, sort of like up there, so about an inch shorter but she did this and yeah, I kind of love it <laughs> so it's fun <sighs> oh, I had a biology test today it went terrible Everyone who does biology at, in year 13 at my school had the biology test today. <sighs> everyone I've spoken to, everyone hated it. Everyone. And this one teacher uh, wrote it. <laughs> he has about 70 girls who all hate him now. <laughs> Somewhere around 60, 70 people all hate him. So that's good. But anyway... If you watched last week's video, you'll know that I've, I have emotional hair. <laughs> yeah, I like a dude and I had given up hope. And then we've talked almost every night this week. We didn't talk on Tuesday because I had parents evening. And we didn't talk tonight because he has a multitude of things. And well, tomorrow's going to be fun because I have been pressured <laughs> into actually doing something because last time I spent two and a half years pining over a guy, well, just over two years, somewhere between two and two and a half. It was quite a while and I got over him and that was good. I mean, it only took a year after he stopped talking to me. <laughs> yeah, I'm not good at people. Yeah, uh, one of my friends starting to push me down the stairs and another one just sat there and death glared me <laughs> until I agreed. They don't know each other, they've never met, they did this separately. <laughs> the one who death glared me has actually never been in a relationship. So I don't know why she was giving me dating advice. It was very weird. Oh well. I think that's everything that's happened this week. I'm fairly certain that's everything that happened this week. I mean, pretty much the main thing. Other stuff might have happened, but I've not really been aware of it because my brain has been kind of on a one track thing I mean I was doing trig yesterday while we were talking to him I still haven't finished it seriously I started question 13 when we started talking I'm currently halfway through 14b I mean it's multiple sheets of paper because it's all of this and then some others but it took me far too long probably because I was watching a TED talk, multiple TED talks, and talking to him at the same time, which is a thing I need to stop doing. Anyway, sorry, I'm really, really not over the hair, but I love it. <laughs> it doesn't get stuck in anything. Unfortunately, it doesn't actually tie up at the moment, so I have to take this bandana to school in order to keep my hair out my face. It's going to be especially important on Tuesday because I'm doing a practical in chemistry. We were supposed to be doing it today, but my teacher just could not be bothered, so we spent the entire lesson planning. <laughs> that was fun. 
Yeah, today was actually a pretty relaxing day, apart from the fact I had a biology test last lesson on a Friday. Because <sighs> my maths teacher, I had maths first, didn't turn up. I help out in the library second and they didn't really have much for me to do, I just put a few books out and then it was tidy the shelves or revise for biology. So they let me revise for biology because that's important. <laughs> then a free in which I did maths because I didn't want to freak out about biology and then I freaked out about biology and revised biology because <laughs> brain. Um, and then I had chemistry in which we just planned the lesson and freaked out about biology because by that point some of my friends had had their test who were in my chemistry class and um, me and my friend who sits next to me who also sits next to me in biology were freaking out because we were panicking uh, and then we had biology and the test that was fun oh no lunchtime we had film club and the teacher who runs it had to run off and do something shortly before the beginning of lunch so he we knew he was going to be maybe 10 15 minutes late he was 40 minutes late. We only had 20 minutes of watching the film. It was a real shame because it was a film he was really excited to show us because we were doing Brazil because our theme for this term is dystopians. And it seemed really cool and I actually want to watch it now. But, ah, uh, oh well. Talking of films, not only was Doctor Strange beautiful, but Fantastic Beasts come out, comes out today. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. But Fantastic Beasts. I'm hopefully going to see it at some point. I'll need to arrange with myself because I'm a sad person who goes to the cinema on their own. <laughs> I mean, there are others I'm interested in, but because of the whole saving for camera and I have to buy people Christmas presents, I have enough to buy a ticket to see one film. I have enough to buy a team ticket to see one film with two quid left over. <laughs> And I'm going to have to take it out of my camera savings in order to save up. Oh, I need a job. Ah. But while I drown here in my misery of not having a job and freak out about the fact that unless I ask this dude out, either I'm going to have a panic attack, which I may do anyway, or my friend is going to threaten to kill me again. Or the other one's going to yell at me and quite possibly hit me. <laughs> anyway... <laughs> I have a chemistry test next week that I have to prep for and I have to do a lot of maths homework and biology because somehow I still have biology homework. I don't understand. 